but today we will continue our discussion about how the uh, cross mutation affects the pancreatic cancer cells migration ability so in our previous video we have discussed when the cross has been eliminated in the uh, pancreatic tumor cells then it will uh, then the immune systems get active and it's it will be difficult for the pancreatic cancer cells uh, to evade the immune system attack uh, in this video we will uh, discuss more the reasoning behind how the uh, cross mutations the suppression of the cross mutations affects or uh, leads to the increase in the immune response so as the topic suggests that cross suppresses fast expression on the pancreatic cancer cells fast is that is that is that cell receptors that are expressed on the pancreatic cancer cells so how they have identified where that this cross mutations will affect this fast receptors so in order to identify this thing they developed a model that is they developed a cell lines from the tumor uh, with this doxycycline doxycycline controlled cross mutations that is when the doxycycline is introduced in those kind of cells that is PIKP 785 cells then the cross will be on and when a doxycycline is not induced then cross will be off and uh, this thing they and so they use this kind of uh, they use this cells or this system to find out the what is the intercellular changes that occurs when the cross is on and cross is off and what leads to the behavior of the immune response so first thing they did is they check the expression the expression of this cross on and off uh, quantitatively and they can see that uh, they can see that when the cross is on the expressions are uh, significantly higher compared to the case when this uh, cross is off and they check the uh, results after three days after the cross has been off and five days after the cross has been off and when they did the UMAP analysis and they can see that uh, UMAP analysis of the single cell RNA-seq data of these kind of cells at different point of times they can see that the single cell RNA-seq data behaves differently for different conditions for example when the cross is on the single cell RNA-seq data represents differently in the UMAP compared to the case when this cross is off and also when the cross is off and on intermediately then also it behaves differently this indicates that there is a, a continuous changing that is going on that is related to the uh, cross mutation and, and they uh, apart from this uh, UMAP which shows that there is intracellular changes that is all going on uh, within the pancreatic cancer cells because of the cross mutations they also check these cross levels at uh, this different stage and they can uh, see that cross levels are high when the uh, cross mutations are on and there is on and off conditions are going on compared to the case when this cross is off and when they uh, do this pathway analysis immune related pathway analysis between five day off versus on they can see that significant enrichment in the immune response related pathways uh, compared to the case of when the uh, cross mutations are on so this indicates that the immune response get uh, more uh, active in the case when these cross mutations are off and thereafter uh, they check based on the gene set enrichment analysis they identify uh, the here is the gene set enrichment analysis they identify that it's the uh, fast receptors that has been significantly uh, upregulated uh, when the cross mutations are off compared to the case when the cross mutations are on they can see that the for the three days its up, uh, value goes up to 40 and for five days its value goes up to 70 so and this is these values are uh, re related to gene set enrichment analysis that is these are the relative values and they also check their expression levels in the normalized form and they can see that when the uh, more the uh, times this task mutations remains off the higher is the expression levels of these fast receptors and fast receptor is the that receptors that will trigger apoptosis when interacts with the immune cells and and this is the relative fast expressions between 
the on and off case this is the normalized value and this is the relative expressions between on and uh, three day off and five day off and they can see that with the uh, more the times uh, it passes when the cross mutations are off the higher the expression of these fast receptors and this is the uh, you can say flow cytometer normalized mode flow cytometer analysis here also we can see that uh, with increase in the uh, time of cross mutations remains off there is an increase in the fast receptor signals and it again uh, goes down when the cross mutations uh, is again activated using doxycycline so these are the the final figure is with the 14 days off and 10 days on here we can see that the on and uh, these conditions are uh, almost overlap to each other and and this is just uh, another representation of this uh, fast plus cells that are uh, find out so this is the quantitative this is the flow cytometer analysis and its quantitative analysis is shown in the uh, panel j here also we can see that when the three weeks three weeks it remains off uh, we can see the highest we can see the highest uh, amount highest number of this highest percentage of relative highest relative expression of this fast receptors or the dead cell receptors this is also in line with the hypothesis that CRAS will uh, modulate this fast receptors expression of the pancreatic cancer cells and thereafter they check the apoptosis pathway or the what are the not pathway apoptosis apoptotic cells and they can see the significant increase in the apoptosis uh, when the cross mutations are off compared to the case within cross mutations are on and within this apoptosis they check uh, the as we know that when the, uh, the apoptosis pathways are triggered uh, this signaling path is uh, the signaling pathways of the apoptotic uh, process includes this uh, caspase 8 expression and we can see that the caspase 8 expression increases uh, as uh, as the time as the time uh, as the time occupied or time spent by cells when the cross mutations are off so this is this just shows the increase in the caspase 8 absorbance so this all these the figures pointed out or made a point made made a point or proved the hypothesis that cross suppresses the FAS or dead cell expressions so this is how they uh, validate their point about this cross and fast receptors relation in the pancreatic cancer cells so I hope you understand this figure and if you need to understand more about uh, more details about this uh, experiment that is related to this figure you can go through the reference that has been provided in the description that's all for this video thank you for your time